But let's talk entertainment. It's official. Gwen Stefani and Blake Shelton are getting engaged. The couple broke the news on social media yesterday, and they are extremely excited. They uh, fell in love on the set of The Voice in 2015. Of course, uh, they're fellow judges on that show, and they've collaborated on several duets since then. And uh, Shelton previously told People magazine that he and the No Doubt singer bonded over their respective divorces. So they are getting hitched. And you may remember Gwen Stefani was once married to Bush lead singer Gavin Rosdale. Remember that band? Glycerine! That one's for the 90s kids. Meanwhile, Jon Stewart coming back to TV. This is huge. He's going to be hosting and producing a current affairs series for Apple's streaming subscription video service. That is, of course, Apple TV+. Plus. It will be his first regular TV gig since he left The Daily Show in 2015. Apple hasn't announced the show's title or when it will air, uh, but each episode will be an hour long. It will cover daily news topics and uh, alongside his advocacy work, which includes better healthcare access for wounded veterans and first responders in the 9-11 attack. So John Stewart coming back to TV for Apple TV Plus. And first time around, the Kazakhstan Tourism Board was not happy with the first Borat movie. Now, 14 years later, they are embracing it. They're actually taking a different approach. They've adopted Borat's catchphrase, very nice, to try and promote tourism in the vast Central Asian country. They've got a slick video there with the, from the tourism board showing mountains, lakes, exotic food, futuristic cityscapes, all in a bid to uh, help attract tourists to Kazakhstan. There you go, very nice. So they're uh, embracing Borat this time around. Stick around, Russ has your full look at weather. We'll